Hi there YouTube, Classic Collector and today I'm gonna be doing an unboxing on Kari's and Gatoman's uh, pink Digivice. Here in the United States we only got the orange and the blue Digivice which the orange being um, Agumon's and Ty's and the blue one being Matt and Gabumon. Um, so this one I found it in a lot and I messaged the seller and I offered her about $70 for it and she accepted and I asked her if it was new first and she said yeah. So the things about these, you can take them out the box and put them back in uh, for display or whatnot. So they could say it's new, but they could actually mess with it and put it back in the box and say that's new. But she said it was new, I got it and it was new and it is new. Um, the point being of this uh, review slash unboxing that I'm doing, um, it has a battery inside. So after a couple years, or so many long years, you can get uh, the battery to kind of expand and basically it'll, it'll leak and it can mess up the Digivice. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to remove the battery. I'm not going to turn it on or anything. I know some people probably want to see that, which is basically an unboxing, but this is my unboxing. I'm just removing it just so it does not mess up the Digivice. I don't want to mess with it. I really love this Digivice. Um, these usually sell on eBay. I've seen them sell for about 300 the cheapest, sometimes even more, just to uh, it's crazy how the Digimon uh, market goes up and down, but it always stays around $300. So I got very lucky in buying it for $70. Um, and these, uh, the American ones, sorry, I skipped the, ahead, but the American ones, if you were to take it out the box, um, you would have to glue literally the blo the box together. And you could tell if it, if it was used. The box is a little bit different. I have a new one, which I'm planning to do just a review on, just from the outside. And I have one that's already out of the box. So maybe I'll do that review later. But So what I'm going to do, I'm going to take out the Digivice, kind of show you, and I'm going to remove the battery. Okay, so I'll show you the box. It has a Toei animation sticker right here, just to show you that it's real. From here's Bandai. Uh, you got Gatum on here in the front. This is just a sticker that they'll put outside of the Digivices. And they do that on the Season 2, Season 3, and Season 1. Uh, we have Gatum on up here. We have some characters. Uh, we have Gabumon jumping, uh, doing his pepper breath, his battle, and then a whole bunch of instructions. And then on this side, we have Agumon. Or is Agumon Pepper Breath? Uh, I forget, but... And here's his evolution. We have Greymon. And I'm not sure if that's... Let me check. Looks like to be... I'm not sure if it's Metal Greymon or War Greymon. Because you can see his hand. He's got his little... His little... Uh, I don't know what you call them. Gauntlets or... Metal Claws. But So I'm not sure if it goes Agumon, Greymon, and Metal Greymon. Or... His last evolution, but here's the bottom. So we're gonna go ahead and open it from the top. Just stick your finger without damaging the box right in here and just pull it up. Boom. Okay. Comes with a couple instructions, I believe. Okay, so it comes with these two. You get a little booklet. Yep, so for you to pull the tab. So all you can choose, the funny thing on these, okay, so it does let you choose. So you can choose Gabumon, Agumon, I guess all of them. Biomon, Patamon. But I'm not sure if it lets you pick Gatomon. See, that's the, that's, that's the weird thing. Or, or maybe it just doesn't have it on here, but. Okay, yeah, so it has a whole bunch of instructions on here. Okay. I mean, it's pink, so obviously it should have Gatomon, but maybe one day I'll, I'll test it out. But for right now, just I just want to have it for a display, and I really don't want the battery to mess up uh, the Digivice. So here it is, and all you do is pull this out, and you can see the Gatomon sticker on there. I'm trying to be careful with this. Here's the box where it sits in. Pretty nice. Okay, 
Okay, and here we have the Digivice, which is brand new. Um, so the little buttons right here are like rubber. I've seen that when people try to relist them as a uh, new, this is like really worn out. It will turn like white almost on these. So you can tell when people mess around, which right now they're pink. I don't know if the video shows it pretty good, but the buttons are really pink. The Digivice is a nice clear pink. And here you have, you can see the battery right here and the pull tab. So basically you pull the tab and the Digivice will turn on. Um, kind of do not want to pull the tab, kind of tempting, but I know people won't, won't like that. They're like, well, you're doing an unboxing, might as well turn it on. I, like I said, I don't want to. I just want this in my collection. I've always wanted a pink Digivice, but I said they're so expensive, got lucky. And okay, so I got my screwdriver. You want to make sure you get the, the right size. You don't want to strip the bolt, and then you're really going to have trouble if you ever want to put a new battery and then take it out and then you're going to just damage the digivice so make sure you have the right size i'm not sure what size maybe if if i check on here nope it doesn't have the size on here but basically make sure you have the right size before you strip the the little bolt right here and then it, you're gonna have problems trying to get the battery on you're just gonna damage it but basically we're gonna put it in and then i'm gonna turn it left might bring it up a little bit out of the video. I'm sorry, just to do it a little quicker, but. Okay, so, put the bolts out. There you go. Fell off, so. I believe it's just picking it up and sliding. Okay, so you pick it up and then you slide it out. And there we have the battery with the pull tab so what i'm going to do i'm just going to remove the battery okay so if you can see here it has a nice little pocket to put the battery in so i'm wondering how to take it out without damaging it huh wonder if I could just pull the battery out or... Like I said, I've never done this, so I don't do not know how long this take. And I'm trying to not touch the screen too much on the Digivice, but I'm really trying to figure out how to do it without damaging it. Because if you see right here, it has these two little pins. Maybe let me check the instructions. The first thing I should have checked. But... It has nothing on changing the battery, so. So it's almost right here, like these little tabs or keeping the battery pretty set in there. I've tried pushing it down. I've tried sliding it sideways, but... Oh, man. Really trying to figure out how to... how to take it out without... Oh, look at that. So easy. So all I did was pull right here. I'm sorry this took so long. I just really did not want to damage the Digivice. All I did was I pulled it up right here, and it kept... Is keeping the battery from touching it so maybe it wasn't even doing it any harm but I went ahead and took it out we didn't want to take that chance but um, yeah so that's the inside so the battery never made contact with it so it's still brand new and I'm gonna go ahead and and put this back in so what you do is get this slide it up and then we'll put the 
little bolt back in. But yep, there you go, guys. This is my unboxing on my uh, pink Digivice. And I'm just going to put it literally back in the box and just kind of let it sit in the shelf. Um, if you're asking why'd you take out the battery, like I said, sometimes these things will bust and it will damage the inside of the Digivice. I've seen older Digivice that it happens depending where you're keeping them at. And um, battery's brand new, but I just didn't want to take that risk on such a beautiful piece, expensive piece. Um, but maybe one day I'll I'll put a battery in and kind of do a little gameplay. But I appreciate you guys watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like I said, I'm sorry it took so long. Didn't want to damage it. Um, give me a like, comment. Uh, if you want to see the other Digivice, I have the other two, the orange and the blue one, brand new. I'm thinking of opening one, just haven't decided which one. So just comment below which one you think I should open. And thanks for watching.